Hello friends, in this video we will learn how to configure unbound DNS resolver on PFSense router. Navigate to Services DNS Resolver. Check Enable DNS Resolver. Check Enable SSL TLS Service. Check Enable DNS Sec Support. Scroll down and open Custom Options. Our main aim is to encrypt DNS traffic and prevent DNS leaks. For this, Unbound fully supports DNS over TLS. So I have set here DNS over TLS using Google name servers. Now you should write as I have written. Don't forget to enter the last line forward dash TLS dash upstream colon space yes. Click save. Apply changes. In advanced settings, keep all the settings as default. In SS list, you don't have to add anything. Now I will show you how to enable unbound control command. For this navigate to diagnostics edit file type slash var slash unbound slash remote control dot conf click load here you have to change this control enable line remove no and type yes now click save button Now I will show you some command line utilities to manage DNS cache server. For this navigate to diagnostics open command prompt. Cache can be manipulated on the fly using unbound control. Type unbound control unbound dash control space dash c space slash var slash unbound slash unbound dot conf space reload this command will clear the entire cache Click execute. Now remove reload and type flush underscore zone space google.com. This command will clear all data for a particular zone. Click execute. Now type only dot. 
आफ्टर फ्लस अंडर स्कोर जोन स्पेस डोट दिस कमांड विल क्लियर ऑल डाटा फॉर ऑल जोन क्लिक एग्जीक्यूट यू कैन क्लिक एग्जीक्यूट मल्टीपल टाइम अंटील यू गेट जीरो रीडिंग्स Now remove plus underscore zone. Type lookup space binge dot com. This command will determine the name servers unbound will query to look up a zone. Click execute. Many users have issues where unbound control stop responding. To solve this problem, open Win SCP program and log in to your router using SFTP protocol. Open var folder. Then open unbound folder. You have to delete this last four files that is unbound underscore control dot key unbound underscore control dot pem unbound underscore server dot key and unbound underscore server dot pem delete these four files and reboot your router if you still have problems you can repeat the procedure again thanks for watching my video please click the like button and subscribe my channel